Hey Magic fans, we're back with another box of New Capenna. And uh, I noticed that, you know, I said last week these cards feel fake. Notice there is Wizards wrapping logos on here. So, um, just saying. And I also found out too, another reason why these cards feel fake is these are from Japan. Uh, I don't know if you bought you guys, if you've bought cards from Japan or not. You go to Gala Greeters, which is worth absolutely nothing. Hey, that actually came off all right. Might save that. Um, but the Japan cards are made a little differently, and they do feel weird. So uh, keep that in mind whenever you guys go buy these, because you're not, probably not getting fakes. You're probably getting them from Japan. Just saying. So, let's get started. These wrappers are awful. So, as always, guys, like, subscribe, hit that notification bell. Put some comments down below to help feed that YouTube algorithm. That way we can get some more views on the channel. Appreciate all the help as we're trying to get to 1,000 subscribers still. Alright, so we have a crew captain. Alright, scheme and fence. Devilish valet. Oh, that's a foil. Wow, I can barely tell it's a foil. So a foil rare. <clears throat> Good old tokens. Who thought they would bring those back? So, um, like I said, you know, try and get to a thousand subscribers. As always, if you've done everything you can, there's links in the description to the eBay store. Um, I just got that. Uh, oh, our first rare or our first mythic. Uh, unfortunately, it's a Commander Mythic, but we'll take it. Oh, Triome. Very nice. Wow, another Foil Rare. Back to back. What about that? Um, yeah, we'll put those right there. Um, anyway, links in the description. Uh, you know, to the eBay store. The Patreon. And all those things. The email, if you want to reach out and ask some questions, feel free as we go through a glorious box opening. Oh, there's finally a non-foil, or a non-rare foil. Krinko, 10 Street Kingpin. I don't know how much that's worth. I don't think it's worth a whole lot. We'll put him right there. <clears throat> finally got some good land. All right, oop, commons. Art. Interesting. There was one before and one after. Alright. Charm. Oh, there's a mythic. Rafini Scheme Seer. There we go. Mythic number two. Very nice. We have an incriminate. And nothing. These packs are not as good as to, or not as easy to open as before. Maybe it's because they're from Japan. I don't know. All right, so uncommons. We got that. We got the auger, mysterious limousine, another foil rare. Wow, rabble rousing. That's three foil rares. I don't think any of them are all that hot. To be honest with you, price wise. Boy, these lambs are getting kind of hard to get. Apparently. Not seeing a whole lot of those lands come through like we did in the previous boxes. All right, there's a regular rabble rousing foil, nothing. All right, got one finally. That's only number two. Cure Charm, Revelers, Incendiary Aura Rare, Jackhammer, La Tolkan. Alright, looks like we got another list card. Hopefully it's a good one. Uh, unfortunately, one of the things I've noticed about the list cards after looking at the first box opening, um, they're not worth a whole lot. Uh, there's a Jenny Faye, very nice. Alternate art. Oh, there's another mythic. 
bootlegger stash like that that's a good one screw a storefront and the spear of sage deserter so um like i was mentioned those are the um special uh stranger thing cards that have been reprinted into uh the list slot um and i'm gonna be honest with you most of them are going for a quarter so there's only <clears throat> 67 cards in the list that we talked about. And unfortunately, it's had the effect that I was afraid it was going to have, making the cards worth almost nothing because they're too easy to get. So instead of having a bunch of good list cards, now you only have a couple of good ones. And all the rest are basically commons. Or bulk rares, I should say, technically. Because they are rares. So... There's that. So unfortunately, um, in doing what they could to fix the list, they've managed to destroy and ruin it in the process. Now, three alternate darts. There we go. Triomes in the house. Love them triomes. All right, we're a third way through the box. We've got three mythics and three foil rares. That's uh, pretty high, not gonna lie. So, it's very interesting math. Makes you wonder what the rest of the box is going to be like. Hopefully still good. Oh, look at that. Another Mythic. We have, oh, Obzi. Very nice. Mythic number four. A regular foil. Oh, look at that signature. That is sweet looking. Very nice. Ooh, we got a Gilda. That's a good card. Oh, two rare pack. Fleet Foot Dancer. Oh, wait, that's a foil. And it's not gilded. So that's our fourth foil rare. Um, wow. That's a lot for the box. Um, the last one didn't have that many. Very interesting. Unfortunately, I don't think they're really worth a whole lot. From what I've been seeing. God, why are all the foil lands non-full arts? That is so aggravating. Plaza, Riveters Academy, Foil Charm. Eh. Foil Charm's probably pretty sweet. Uh, for those of you who are wondering, you can get Gilded Foils out of this. Um, apparently they're pretty rare. The last box only had two. Uh, as of right now, I see none. So that's probably not good. Waterfront. The old Shakedown Heavy. Foil regular land so do 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 all right more tokens you know what i might try to sell these tokens because they ain't made tokens in a while like that hey there's a foil one about time so uncommons uncommon professional face breaker i was gonna say puncher Ooh, so we got, oh, nope, not. It's just, just a regular nimble arsonist foil. Unfortunately, it is not gilded. At least it's full art. One of those. We ended up with two that time. Interesting. Ooh, Jetmere himself, the Nexus of Rebels. Good mythic hit. Mythic number five. We're on a roll with those mythics. Well, that's nothing. Structural Assault, and then Voluntary, Involuntary Employment, funny. Ugh, Thousand Wins. So we've gotten nothing but trash out of the list slot. Unless Crink goes a lot higher than I think he is. And commons, some Uncommons. All right. Ledger Shredder, regular foil, 
and nothing. All right. Wow, we ain't got very many list cards in this one, unlike the last one. Nice foil land, finally. The foil full arts are here. It's about time. And the magpie. Trash. Ooh, Void Rend. That's a good card. Eh, Foil Murder. Alright, two thirds of the way through the box. We have hit five Mythics already, which is a pretty good start. Put that over there. Ooh, another Foil. Nice. That's nice three Foil Full Arts. Couple Uncommons. Oh, there we go. Full Art Xander's Lounge. That's a 20 spot, probably. Very nice. Oh, Unleash the Inferno. Bonus rare. Sleeping with the Fishes. All right. Last third of the box, guys. Let's see if we can bring it home with something special. Maybe we can get a big Gilded Mythic. Or something snazzy. Okay, Mistro's Charm. Ooh, try them. Take those all day long. Those are easy five ten dollars spots. Foil Rivers Charm. Ooh, hey, look at that. The Mind Flail. Is that nope? Shamit Creature Horror. I don't think that's worth anything. I'm pretty sure that's from Stranger Things. <clears throat> but hey, you know, I guess at least it's something. More tokens. Uncommons, common, uncommons, uh, cemetery tamper, foil extract the truth. Oh, we got a myth, we got a uh, list card inbound. You know it's worth at least a quarter. It's probably all it's worth. Alright, uncommon. Oh, we got a couple of rares, looks like. We got one rare number one. Ooh. Not gilded, unfortunately, but we have carburetti charm. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. The unhollowed. This guy is like 20, 30 bucks. That's what I'm talking about. Mythic number uh, six from the list. Bringing it home for us for some big money. Very nice. Oops, oops, oops. Alright, Haven Heartstabber, Foil, and Sissel. Or Sissel. Alright. Alright, nothing. Hey, another one. Foil Island. Very nice. I think that's the most foils we've gotten in a box so far, is like three foil lands. Alright, uncommon, uncommon, common. Alright. We have a rare, the Clever Conductor. And the rare that everybody's going to have in their, their decks. Uh, a regular Glamorous Outlaw, unfortunately. Not a Gilded one. Wow, so there's five packs left. We haven't got any Gilded cards. That makes me wonder. We got two Gilded cards in the last box. And they were about five bucks a piece, I think, when I actually looked at them. <clears throat> it makes me wonder, are Gilded cards that hard to get? You know, are we not guaranteed two in a box or one in a box or whatever the case may be? Oh, my lord. Yes, a second full art triumph. Oh, love it. Big money. A devilish verdict. A foil offer you can't refuse. It might be looking that way. It might be looking like these gilded cards are going to be hard to come by. Full uncommons. Common. Hey, there's another mythic. Arcane Bombardment. Very nice. All the mythics pretty much have been from the set. Uh, well, except for this one. So there's mythic number seven. Very nice. I'm just going to initiate and nothing. Wow, we're uh, two packs left. Yet to find any gilded cards. That really makes me wonder if that last box was a, uh, a fluke having two. Or maybe I missed them. I don't know. So, yeah. Uh, it's a mythic, but it's not worth anything. It's commander. Uh, but a mythic nonetheless. So, we'll count it. 
We got the old Jenny Fay regular rare. A regular foil and the fishies. Two packs left, so both these have uh, gilded foils, right? That's how that works. All right, here we go. All right, starting off early, we got a decent rare there from Commander. Uh, Black Market Tycoon, Foil Balloon Brawlers, and nothing. Hmm. One pack left. And we are yet to see another Gilded card. Maybe we just got really lucky with that first pack. And to be honest with you, they weren't even rares. They were just uncommons. So that's very odd. Uh, regular. Cut your losses. Wow. Shield mate. And a token. So, I mean, two, four, six, seven, eight mythics, uh, but no gilded cards. Uh, I think this box feels a lot better price wise than the last one, but we'll go find out. And I'll let you know at the end when we actually tally up the money. So, until next time, guys, remember. Be kind, and I'll see you across from the game table.